The gun violence crisis also hitting one of the city's most recognizable landmarks. David Padro Jr. was shot and killed while in line at Pat's in South Philadelphia. Now we're hearing his father's pain over the senseless shooting. Jasmine Payud is live with what police think led to that gunfire. Jasmine. Jessica, I caught up with the victim's father and other relatives as they went to see their loved one for the final time. My son was very, uh, <sighs> Fighting back tears, this father's silence speaks volumes. Father losing his son, you know, it's my only boy. And not being able to be able to talk to him tomorrow is the worst thing I can ever go through right now. A gunman shot his son and namesake, David Pedro Jr., in front of Pat Stakes in South Philadelphia around 1 o'clock Thursday morning. Investigators believe the gunshots rang out after an argument, presumably about a parking spot, escalated into a physical fight. When that happened, I shot down to Philadelphia to go see him and stuff. Went from there, everything went downhill. The Camden native died at Thomas Jefferson University Hospital. At 22 years old, loved ones say he was known for his humor. He leaves behind a growing family and becomes part of a growing list no one wants to be on. You think the city has a gun violence now? Yeah, now my son's one of them. You know? Do I think we'll ever change? Probably not. Philadelphia police say the gunman in the shooting, now identified as 36 year old Paul Burkert from Reading, initially left the scene and later turned himself into police. What would you say to the guy that did this? Killed a piece of me, you know? Took my little boy, you know? Just. Uh, just hope he gets what he gets, you know? He deserves what he gets in every way. Burgard was charged with murder and weapons offenses. The victim's family has set up a fundraiser to help with funeral expenses. You can find that link on our website, cbsphilly.com. Live in Spring Garden, Jasmine Payute, CBS 3, Eyewitness News. And Jasmine, tonight a Pennsylvania congressman is calling for urgent action on the city's gun violence epidemic. Representative Dwight Evans wrote letters to both Philadelphia Mayor Jim Kenney and President Biden. Evans says a declaration of emergency from the mayor could send a signal that the issue is one of his administration's top 